Good evening and welcome to ATV News. My name is Shella Malawson. On tonight's bulletin, the youth are sidelined in family planning programs. Massive deforestation threatens Mutare Mountains. Jalopis is travel woes for Dumboshawa Fog. And Karate Champion Sensei Moripo talks about his success. Despite some teenagers being sexually active, the law does not allow contraceptives to be given to youths of school-going age. Muchana Tachimuka reports. Kushai is quite a zero for money. She could shandy some money at the Kurunga Muri Kunevichi Diki, Kurukunza Matam Zikuakawanda. Kajinji Vaberek into over Kupomer one more so I could teach Diki Vashai Squenzira Quadzo, the good Ziviri Rapamuviri. At times we are not there. I can say no, no, but when that child is determined to do things, they usually do it. But when they know that mom and dad don't allow me to do these things and if they respect you they will try not to do something that is outside the family teachings kadandara anokurudzira vechidiki kuti vasamhanyire kupinda munyadze pabonde can't you wait until the right time and the right man or the right woman comes but as they grow i would also expect them to make an informed decision Kunyangwa masangano anofanira kubatsira vechidiki ari kukundikana kuvabatsira. Kati ndi kacho kuti tipe mwana vechidiki tichine tinosungwa nemtemo. Kati tenge vanotofanira kuti ngo tenge tangu vanogona kuzongotora zvavo kumwe but so tenge tsinga vakuruzi kuti vashandise makondo. Vechidiki vanotsana ngura nezvo zvikonzero zvinoita kuti vakundikane kuwana rubatsiro urwu. The barriers that exist in terms of us being able to access key services, um, for example, HIV testing and counselling, contraceptives, um, there are a lot of barriers hinged a lot on the fact that society believes um, that young people should not be, or should not know such issues, should not even go and access such services. All these services, when you want to access as a youth, there is the money of these centres by elderly people, and most of the times you face stigmatisation. Deputy Prime Minister Tokozani Kube akaparura chirongwa che World Population Day Sondorino akatsinira kuti kushaiswa zvekushandisa kunowedzera uwandu hwepamuviri pasingadi kanwi ndiri mtorwe na we ATV ndiri muHarare Zimbabwe With power cuts on the increase residents in Mutare are now cutting down mountain trees for firewood increasing the risk of landslides Andrew Mambondiani gives us the story the once green mountains surrounding the eastern border city of Mutare are now bare as residents continue to cut down trees excessively for firewood. Residents who spoke to ATV said Zesa power cuts are forcing them to rely on firewood for cooking. The situation has been worsened by residents who are starting fires, burning forests on the mountains. An environmentalist say the illegal cutting down of trees has reached alarming levels in the city. Mundenda said environmentalists are now spearheading a reforestation program in the affected areas. Tine urongwa wakati one day, wanga urukwitwa ni wangari wema mtare, kubudikiza ne kanzuro, 
iri kubatsirawo zvakare kuti tiedze kusima miti mumasango akatenderedza mutare if no steps are taken to curb deforestation now environmentalists fear that it may trigger massive landslide should the country get excessive rains reporting for ATV in Mutare Zimbabwe Old and unregistered vehicles are now providing relief to travelers in Dambushawa. These vehicles are working in areas that are normally shunned by transport operators. Jeffrey Moyo reports. Battered old vehicle models dating back to the 70s and 80s are still on the road in Dambushawa, about 30 kilometers north of Harare, helping to ferry people into the deep rural interior. The creative Mchova operators are playing a significant role in getting people to work, schools, clinics and distant locations. The routes they ply have bad roads and are being shunned by public transport operators. Most of the vehicles which include old sedans and pickups are not registered. As my challenges are to face up and they BM, BM to be my police. I should say that most. I don't think I will get. I don't go back. I don't go. I don't go. Most of the time, we are going to be. 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 But it's just that it's not most or it's one most. Despite operating illegally, the taxi pirates are playing a critical role to ease transport blues in the Dombosha community. The operators are bitter about the failure of the rural district council to maintain the roads which has pushed up their vehicle maintenance cost. The mchovas are not comfortable and locals have no option. The old vehicles serving various Domosha rural communities will one day be part of a history illustrating how locals once traveled. Reporting for ATV, I'm Jeffrey Moyo in Domoshawa, Zimbabwe. Award-winning karate champion Sensei Moribo is preparing for a world championship match in Japan in four months. Robert Tafumane recently caught up with him during training. Zimbabwe's first karateka to win the African World Karate Championship three years ago is passionate about the sport and confident about his success in future. ATV recently visited the karate champion during training at a local club where he was preparing for the World Championship match to be held in Japan in November. <laughs> And got a champion midweight in uh, 2010. They got a international tournament in the Japan, which is over perfect. They got a number two um, open weight category. 2011, Zendano defender Tato Yangu, Kazakhstan. They got a number two in the Japanese Muripo says it takes discipline to be a champion in the field of martial arts. Uh, Zimbabwe's karatekas who are being groomed by Muripo ahead of Japan to spoke highly of him. He has helped us even in our physical strength. He has helped us to take out even the weight, the workouts and everything. We are back effective even the sicknesses and everything. He has given us the spirit of courage in us. He has made us to be, uh, we feel we are men in everything, in every respect. 
the karate champion has in the past won matches against renowned fighters such as Matuya San Agvan and Yunash Hotlov, Arsenal of Russia, Germany's Grand World Atel, and you know Masachi of Japan. He has also clinched many awards, including gold and silver medals at international matches. Reporting for ATV, I'm Robert Afumane in Harare, Zimbabwe. Thank you for joining us. Good night. Thank you.